Hi, my name is Bob Morris and I want to talk to you about my 16 Egret Carbon Kevlar boat. My passions on the water are spending time with my wife and kid and tournament fishing inshore. And the 16 Egret is a great boat for both pursuits. The most important thing when spending time with the family is having a nice comfortable platform. This boat is super dry and it's a super soft riding boat. For tournament fishing, I like the fact that it's got a long range that holds 41 gallons of fuel so we can make long runs and get back to the ramp without a problem. It's got a great live well. The boat's fast. It'll run in the 50s with my 130 E-Tech and it also will pull shallow in less than nine inches of water. So it's a great boat for tournament fishing, but it's also a great boat for the wife and kid. My wife is very comfortable. My child is very comfortable. The boat is stable and it's very smooth riding. We can fish inshore, we can go off the beach, we've caught tarpon, we've won tournaments in it together, so it's been really uh, great for my wife and son. One of the most important things for me personally was to have a nice soft riding boat. Unfortunately, I've got a bad back, I've got titanium plates in my neck, and many other boats have a bone jarring ride that would just leave me fatigued by day's end and I don't experience that at all in the egret. It certainly rides a lot bigger than its footprint. One of the great things about the 16 egret is the amount of storage. It's really phenomenal the amount of storage they've engineered into this boat. For such a small boat you can really bring a whole lot of stuff with you. One of the neatest things I found when I first got the boat home was that it's got these convenient thoughts floors. So anything that you really don't need to have readily available, extra dock lines, I keep my tournament weigh-in bag down here. There's a ton of storage in the false floor. On top of the false floor, I keep things like my throwable, my backpack, rain gear, net. Uh, of course, with the carbon Kevlar model, you've got the beautiful carbon Kevlar hatches. Uh, just a little bit of extra bling for you there. The 16 Egret is a great fishing platform. You notice up here at the bow, there's plenty of space for two anglers to fish side by side without being in each other's way. The other thing that really sold me on the boat is the fact that it's so stable. You can walk from side to side without the boat moving much. My last boat, unfortunately, the first couple of times my child went out with me, he fell right over the side because the boat was so tippy. Another great thing about the boat is the rod lockers. There's plenty of room in the rod lockers for six or eight rods per side. When I used to bring my son fishing, one of the things that was very important to me is that he's not exposed to a bunch of treble hooks. So everything's locked away. It's just a nice safety feature if you're fishing with small kids or your family. Also, in tournament fishing, it's important to have a clear deck. So basically, all your rods are put up. There's not anything to get caught on if you're fighting a fish. So the rod lockers are super nice. The other thing I've noticed is that they're very quiet. You can walk on them without making any noise. Other manufacturers, if you walk on the rod lockers, they're going to squeak and make noise, but not with the egret. Another great feature is all the storage under the seat. You'll see there's plenty of room for all of your tackle and anything you want to bring. He's very cleverly put the batteries down here in their own little area that's covered. Um, they're easy to get to. That's one thing I notice about this boat is everything's engineered where it's easy to work on. If you have a problem, you can easily get to all the wiring. You can get to your batteries easily, and that's a great thing. Um, it's not like you have to be a contortionist to work on the egret. There's also a lot of storage in the aft wells. This is an optional crab well. However, I chose to have it just be extra storage. It's great to put a soft-sided cooler in there. And it's got my towel. Um, there's a lot of room in there, but if you wanted to have that plumbed as a live well, you could certainly do that. That is a, a factory option. And on the other side is gonna be my oil reservoir. I call this my mechanical room. I've got my power pole pump in there, my oil reservoir, just another handy storage unit. Another great thing about the 16-foot egret is that it truly self-bails. There's deep gutters on all the hatches. The decks are cambered, so they're slightly arched, which means no water gets standing anywhere. Uh, if you can look at the side, you'll see that the scupper is clearly above the water line. The deck is higher than that, so everything bails out without a problem. One of the great things about pulling this boat is this step. It makes it easy to get up onto the platform. Well, there again, the egret's nice and stable, so it's a real pleasure to pull. It's very light. The carbon Kevlar model is very light, very easy. You'll notice that we're very uh, horizontal at the water line. It's a nice balanced load with Chris on the front and me on the back. As you can see, when you're pulling the 16 egret, 
It's not squatting in the stern. It's a very stable, very balanced pulling skiff.